Dot, dot, dot. It's over for me. <laughs> Hello, it's your goth queen, Draco Kali VR, and welcome to Three Scary Games. Yes, I know I'm not the first one to do this type of content, but you know, I wanted to do something a little different. You know, bear with me, and wanted to give you guys something new, a little different, if you catch my drift. This first game we're going to be playing is called Leave Me Alone. It's a VHS PlayStation 1 styled horror game, and if you know me, I love this type of horror. I'm not going to keep y'all waiting any longer. Wast to walk, shift to run, see the switch camera, E or... okay. Oh. <laughs> I love this already. All right. E. Oh. Ten AM. I better get ready to meet up with Noah. The haircut. I need to grab the backpack and as a precaution, a lighter, in case we decide to make a campfire. Already. Oh, we're just oh. Gotcha. The controls in this game is like interesting. Oh, I'm struggling at the get it to the door. Oh, is that a PlayStation One, PlayStation Two? Okay. Casually moonwalking. <laughs> this this game controls are weird. My god, this game controls are just so weird, I'm not used to it. Let's turn this way, yeah. Leave the house. Alright! If you say so, leave the house, we do. <laughs> the crazy stance! Alright, leave the house, we do. Mm-hmm. Oh. Doom doom. They're being followed. Ooh, spooky. Finally, we've arrived. Finally, we we have arrived. Well, let's get to it. How about this, Jackson? You set up the tent, and I'll go gather some wood for the campfire. What do you think? All right. <clears throat> I'll start setting up the tent. Oh, set up the tent. <gasps> okay. Oh, okay. Retrieve the backpack from the car. You gotcha. The, the controls in this game is so weird. Oh. Just carefully turn like here and then access that. All right, on our way to our campsite. Yep, yep, here we go. Retrieve the let. Oh, there's more? There is? Here we go. Okay, we got a lantern. We're gonna do some amnesia type shit. Mm-hmm. Explore the map and wait for Noah. Ooh, I do love me some exploring in the woods. All alone, with nothing to worry about. Yeah, totally nothing to worry about. As we can't explore the map. No, we're just... Guess we're just exploring. So we'll just explore it somehow as we wait for... Who's he? I already forgot the name of the guy that they were talking about. 
Some interesting camera. Left! Or right? That's the thing we do. Left is the greatest. Left is the greatest. And here we go. Oh. Yeah, this is perfect to camp to. Yeah, camp near a graveyard. Yes. <laughs> Clearly this is a graveyard. That's a gravestone. That's another gravestone. Another gravestone. Yeah, I think this is... Oh. Noah's back to the tent. Oh. Macabre Discovery in Whispering Woods Cemetery. September 19, 1982. The tranquility, the tranquility of the peaceful Whispering Woods Forest was once disrupted by a sinister discovery when a body was found in the local cemetery. Residents who frequent the forest for outdoor activities and visit the cemetery and perplexed by the disturbing event. Details are scarce, but initial reports indicate that Passerbury body Peserbury discovered the body during a morning walk through the cemetery authorities were immediately alerted and conducting th a conducting a thorough investigation to determine the victim's identity as well the circumstances to that lead to this ominous the area around the cemetery has temporarily hardened off as investigators seek evidence and clarification on, in on an incident so far there is no information on eyewitnesses or possible subjects residents are expressing growing unease reigniting old rumors and dark stories associated with the forest and the cemetery authorities are appealing for community public collaboration urging everyone anyone with relevant information to come forward to assist in solving this dark mystery the investigation is ongoing and updates will provide as more em emerges all righty so creepy shit let's go back to the tent I do apologize for my little shitty reading skills. I'm not the best at reading. All I can say, I suck at it. Do you have something to light the campfire? I brought a lighter. It's in the car. I'll go get it. What's with this voice acting? Sounds like it's just used AI just to use voice acting. Like, come on. But you know, I don't judge horror game developers, but they do with their games but if any game developers want to uh hire me hire me please a long time passed jackson and noah talked for hours mm-hmm noah it's very late and i'm tired i'm going to sleep I'm going to sleep too. I'm exhausted. All right. Good night, Noah. Good night, Jackson. Oh. What was that? Oh, I'd better wake up Noah. Where is Noah? Oh, he slept outside. What a smart idea. I'll find Noah. Oh. It's finding Noah time. Here we go. Here we go. On our way to find Noah in the spooky forest. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, let's go find Noah. Noah, are you over in the graveyard? Have you been exploring a little? Oh, no, you've been here already. That's where I really horrifically butchered that whole entire paragraph. All right. Come on, Noah. You're scaring me. Stop playing this hide and seek trick. It's hide and seek, seek shit. I don't know why. But you gotta chill, man. On our way to find Noah. Oh, a creepy building. Is it abandoned? Hmm. Well, we can't enter it. Noah, where where you at? 
You're scaring me a little bit. Come on, show yourself. You can't just keep hiding from me. No reason. My question is, why explore a forest late at night when it's pitch black outside? Kinda not be a safe idea. If I were you, I would turn back. We take our risks. Oh, well our only way is to go that way. We're kinda limited here. All right, we're exploring this creepy fucking meadow. Excuse my ink, oh. Noah, it's making me nervous all here. Oh yeah, explore a random house in the middle of the woods. Oh, how nice. Oh, we're just... Any, anything over there? Noah, you in here? Do you explore a little too far? It's a casual TV just here. What's weird? It's kind of weird. Oh! Oh, is that Slipknot? That's cool. Time to die. Oh. Oh. Hey. Hey. Is this is some new cool Slipknot shit. Oh. Oh. We're dead. The man just fucking went through the wall! Yeah, I don't think this game is even possible to play. Yeah, I don't think this game is even possible to play. The controls in this game is really weird, and I do not like how the controls are. So... Let us transition. This next game is called the VHS Paradise. It's another PlayStation 1 styled horror. The last game that we played, I had a hard time trying to play it because the controls were a bit wanky. Wonky? I don't know what you want, how you want to say it, but it was hard for me to play it. Let's try out this one. Oh, okay. Ooh. Oh, is this our job? What does it say? Hi, Robert. I hope you're doing. I hope you are well. I hate this damn fe fever, but I'm recovering. Remember to start your shift by turning on the computer. I left a good movie for you to watch when you finished work. By the way, I heard that the rate of thieves increased a lot in the city and much more at n nighttime. Pay attention to what each customer is doing. If you see one leaving without paying, run to stop him and be very careful, John. Yeah, I'll watch the movie after work. Okay. Oh. Start shift? Yes. A very old computer. Hello! Welcome to the VHS Paradise. I am... I am your, uh, worker. Draconia. Wait, wait, hey. Hey. Hi. Hey. Hello. Hello, sir. Find, any, find anything you've been looking for? Can I help you? Got a VHS to buy? You're not gonna steal an iron. Hey, 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 hey! Please, dude, I really want this to see this movie, but my parents won't let me the money. No. Hi, welcome to the VHS Paradise. Hello, ma'am. Find anything you've been looking for? Oh my, that's a big smile you got there. Don't steal anything. Mm -hmm. Anything I can help you find, miss? Anything? Not stalking, but make sure you don't steal. Mm, you gonna buy? Goodbye. Okay, she's she's actually might gonna buy something. Hey, that'll be uh twelve dollars. Hello, I wanted to rent this movie for three days. Good evening, it's four dollars. Here you go, my son will love this gift. Is this a gift for your son? 
Don't you think you should buy the movie instead of renting it? No, he watches the movie repeatedly for the first few days and then completely forgets about them. Haha. Uh -huh. He is 11 years old. He loves action movies. Oh, okay then. Thanks for your purchase. Thanks to you. Goodbye. Thank you for buying. I wish movies costed that much, but not anymore. Hi! Welcome to the VHS Paradise. Welcome to the store. Can I find you anything? You gonna buy something? No, 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 no! Don't touch me, asshole! Call the police if you want, I don't care. No, you are not. No money. You get out. No movie for you. Can't steal movies on my watch. I run fast. Hi, welcome to VHS Paradise. Hope you enjoy your stay. Just don't steal anything. I'll be watching you. You gonna buy or run? Make your decision wisely. Good. Good. You chose the best decision. Hello, friend. I want to buy this movie. It's $20. Excellent. Finally. Finally what? I have finally reached 100 movies purchased. I love collecting these wonders. Do you even watch these movies? No, I don't see them, but I buy them to decorate my house. Okay, are you going to pay or what? Ah, yes, take it. Thank you very much. All right. Enjoy your house decoration. Did not watch the movie. Weird guy. Hey, miss. You gonna keep or run? You choose. You gonna buy? Good decision. Hello, I'm taking this movie for one dollar one day. It's two dollars, right? Hello, yes. Well, I'm new to I'm new in this city, you know. It's pretty mu it's pretty, but I've heard this but I've heard there's a lot of crime. Yes, be careful. Did you move here or are you on vacation? I'm moving here with my husband. We hope everything goes well. Oh, I understand. Well, I have to go. Good night. Goodbye, good luck. Didn't take care. Mm -hmm. Enjoy your movie. Let's explore around. Check this out. Oh, we can't go in here. <gasps> There's a basement. Oh! Customer, customer, customer. Hey! Welcome to the store. Welcome to VHS Paradise. You coming and running. Okay, good decision, old man. Naughty rabbits in a sexy adventure. Do you want to buy or rent it? I want to buy it. Okay, it's $20. Here's the money. I'm surprised you are the only cashier who doesn't look at me with a disgust or a rejection when he sees that I want to buy a movie like that. Oh. The truth is, I don't give a damn. You can go now. I also like this movie. It's very exciting. I'm sorry, but I'm not allowed to chat with customers. I I have to choose the shop now. I don't have time to stay and talk with you. Thank you for the purchase. Let's do two. No, let's do three. Uh, sorry. Enjoy the movie. Bye. I hope this is not a decision game. If I make a bad decision, I'll die. Let's check out the basement real quick before we hear another... Well, my shift is over. Let's watch the movie that John left me. But well, let's check out Basement. Basement looks cool. Basement, I like. Oh, stamina. I love stamina. All right. Let's watch the movie that John left me. Yes. What a me me what a meteoric movie. I've never seen such a predictable ending. I wonder what John saw in this to recommend it to me. I better go home. I'm tired of being here. Oh, we just end up in the basement. I explore a basement, then we end up here. <laughs> All right. It's a normal day. 
third ending, you arrived home safely. Well, that was an interesting game. We didn't really experience much scares, but apparently there's three endings. But I don't think I have time to go through that. So if you guys want me to go back to this game or come back to this game to explore all three endings, let me know. Moving on. The last game we're going to be playing is called Dead Faces Prologue Demo. This will be the last horror game we'll be playing for today. And this seems like an interesting game because I love the music. And uh, let's begin. It's been two years since you lost everything. Isolated for years in your apartment, you can't remember their faces. Their faces portray a loss buried underneath the stars. The line between reality draws every thin trust not in the mind, but in the but trust in the visions. You must remember their faces, Jack, or the nightmare will never end. Okay. Oh! A way to start, yes. Thank you. The, un the unknown visitor. Oh my god, the, ooh. the mouse sensitivity is pretty strong. E to interact, Q to examine. Ooh. 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 <laughs> it is 3 o'clock, 3 in the morning, 3 a.m. Pretty spooky. Once I run out of money, I won. It's over for me. Hmm. All right. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you again. All right. Requires a key. Well, we gotta find a key. Where could a key be hidden? Hmm. Psycho Blood Scream? A very interesting book title. All right. Where could a key be? Oh, fuck. Oh, we're, oh, we're standing on the bed now. <gasps> okay. <laughs> oh, no, we need the door open. It says the door requires a key. Can we find the key? Milk. Just casual milk. What? Hello? Hello? Please make your mind get a duck. Oh, I'm losing my mind again, they say. You must remember their faces. Hi? How about close the door? I'm not a... Oh, is he still out there? No, we, we're not gonna open the door. I don't know who that was. But I'm sure I do not want to speak to them. You're still here. Hi. I remember your face. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? Oh. Okay. Spooky big man. That's a big boy. You must remember their faces. Ew. Um, hi! Hello? Uh, 
No, no, baby. Hey. This is some PT shit. Some PT shit. Oh! 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 The house is on fire! But I can't leave this spot. I'm stuck. Please don't go. Oh. Soap! Foop! Soap, protect me, please. Please. Soap, I ask you quite nicely. What the fuck is that? Remember what you did, Jack. Why did they deserve this? Oh my god. Okay. Oh, you creepy clown. Oh, creepy clown goes down. Beautiful. Choir is like. It's over. Dot, dot, dot. It's over for me. Ah! Oh! Oh! Hey! 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 Creepy big boy, big big man. Hi. My cooking. That's a big dude. Uh, uh, uh. I can't move. I can close the door on you! <laughs> Examine. Examine. Your fault. No, it's not. Where's this big man? Oh, he, he's hanging. Just hang in there, sir. I'm sorry. Bad joke. Bad timing. Still requires a key. So that was three scary games. I hope you all enjoyed these games that I randomly picked out and I'll have them linked down in the description. Yes, I know there wasn't full footage of all these games, but they needed to be chopped into one video so you guys can get three scary games, but I'm not going to keep y'all waiting here too long. I'm going to head on out. Y'all take care and I'll see you guys on the flip side. Mommy!